Oh, it's time. Beat LA Phoenix Suns with a dominating win over the Los Angeles Lakers. Let's go. What's going on, AZ Sports fan family? The Phoenix Suns just dominated the LA Lakers on Game 5 in the most best way possible. This was our home court advantage. Played two here, played two in LA, and came right back. And the Phoenix Suns absolutely obliterated the LA Lakers. Now, let's go ahead and say this right now. Be LA in the comments below. Now, a couple different things I want to talk about before anything. Now, obviously, we came off a dominant performance. Devin Booker was looking all sorts of awesomeness. Uh, Cameron Payne was looking fantastic as well. Chris Paul did kind of go through a scare as well where he seemed to have got pushed down and went on his, uh, his shoulder. He did actually end up going and getting both free throws, but he ended up getting you know removed from the game, which is probably for the best for Chris Paul's health and for the Phoenix Suns moving forward. That's a story I'm definitely gonna follow very, very closely in terms of the health of Chris Paul because we need him at 100% or at least 90 to 80%. That's where we need Chris Paul to close out the series and beat them four games out of the seven series. Now, this game right here was the game that I was hoping that we were going to see, you know, on game two and game three. But nevertheless, we were two and two coming into game five and we just look absolutely domination on the LA Lakers. Now, granted, they did not have Anthony Davis. Now, I don't know how far or how long Anthony Davis is going to be out. He was a game time decision today, but obviously I think 30 minutes to 40 minutes prior to the game started, um, they said that he was not going to be playing, that he was out with a groin injury. Um, I don't know what the extent of is he, if he's going to be even playing on Thursday, which is going to be game six. Now, if there is going to be a game seven, obviously the Lakers do need to beat the Phoenix Suns on game six. Now that is going to be an LA home game as well so I don't know what the health is of AD is but we do need to take care of business and we need to take care of business fast so I would love for the Phoenix Suns to take this series in game six um, I think it's the best way possible to bring this momentum that we had coming into week five and basically just coming out and showing out but we were obviously the more physical team on both sides of the ball, offensively, we were looking dynamite. Defensively, we were looking good. In the first half, I don't think LeBron James really knew what to do. There was a lot of poor miscommunication between the team. A lot of balls getting thrown outside. And just because poor communication that was happening with the Lakers. But that only really benefited the Phoenix Suns moving forward. So absolutely dynamite. Absolutely dynamite win for our Phoenix Suns moving forward, guys. Let me know what you guys think. Now, I know there's going to be a lot of people saying, we will see you on game six. Don't worry about it. We got AD coming back and everything is going to be good. Let me know what you guys think, Suns fans, or anybody that's currently watching this. Do you think we will have the Phoenix Suns in six games? Let me know, guys, in the comments below. This is such a fantastic way to end my night. Hashtag BLA. Thank you so very much for watching, guys, and see you at game six.